and we have our first views of the Axiom crew members floating aboard. First is Commander Peggy Woodson rejoining the International Space Station. Next up is pilot John Schaffner making his first visit. Also on his first trip to space, you can see Ali Al Karni representing the Saudi Space Commission. All smiles as he floats through the Dragon Hatch. And rounding out the Axiom 2 crew, that's Rihanna Barnawi, also of the Saudi Space Commission. The crew of the space station is now 11 crew members. Big smiles from Rayana Barnawi. She is now the first female Saudi to go to space. With Commander Peggy Whitson at the helm, these astronauts are in good hands. Peggy has 665 days already lived in space. She's just adding to that total on this mission. John Schaffner, his first trip to space. Getting some help out from Woody Hoberg, NASA astronaut, who is also on his first trip to space. He's been on the space station now for 81 days. Again, the total number of astronauts and cosmonauts on board the International Space Station now at 11. Three of the astronauts on the space station represent NASA, three represent Roscosmos, two represent the Kingdom of Saudi Arabia, one represents the United Arab Emirates. Again, we are standing by for the start of the welcome ceremony. The crew will take some time to do some scene and voice checks and make sure that uh, their microphones are set up properly, as well as that we have them all in frame before going into their welcome remarks. And of course, afterward, we will wrap our coverage before they step into uh, their work and life aboard the International Space Station for the next eight days. Station Houston on two for Frank and PIO. Hey, Frank, I uh, just wanted to tag up with you on the PAO event. Uh, we're thinking about doing a scene and voice in about seven minutes from now. Uh, will that work for you? 
That'll be perfect. Uh, we will call you back in about, uh, and we can even do five minutes if you guys want, but we'll call you back in seven minutes. Copy that. Uh, we prefer closer to seven minutes as we have a handover in about five minutes from now. Sounds great. As you heard the Capcom relay to NASA astronaut Frank Rubio, we are expecting a handover. We're expecting that short handover in just a few minutes. Um, we want to make sure that we have great audio and video from our visiting astronauts. So we are holding for that short handover and then we will start the welcome ceremony. Again, we arrived this morning at 8.12 a.m. Central Time, the Dragon Hatch opening at 10 a.m. Central Time, and then crew members floating aboard just moments ago. Ali Al Karni, it looks like he already has the hang of things on his first flight to space. The Axiom crew has trained for months in preparation for this mission. The Axiom crew has been training for months in preparation for this mission here at Johnson Space Center as well as at SpaceX, working with teams on uh, the research that they will be conducting as well as learning space station systems. <laughs> 